Yeah, Mr. White! Yeah, science! Yeah, magnets! You have to have seen Breaking Bad and this movie to understand that joke. Trust me, it's funny. <laughs> Slight, as in Slight of Hand, is directed by J.D. Dillard and it stars Jacob Lattimore as a struggling magician who lives in a bad part of L.A. and he's just trying to get his little sister and him out of that bad area. He's trying to be a magician and do, you know, get, make money doing that, but he's not making enough money doing that, so he starts doing some drug dealing and at first it's fine, but then one thing after another happens and then he, uh, the shady things start going down. This is a movie that I heard nothing about going in. I knew nothing about it. I might have seen a teaser trailer, like d just a quick ad on YouTube or something, but I really hadn't seen anything for this movie. So going in, I was completely blind and I did not know what to expect. This movie's amazing. Let me just, I, I, let me just start by saying this. This is probably my favorite movie of the year so far. It blew me away. It, it took me by surprise. I had no idea what was going to happen. It kept me on the edge of my seat the entire time. It was engaging. It was interesting. It was new. This movie is phenomenal. I, I could not believe how much surprise this movie took me by. I, I, I absolutely love this movie. Okay, so like I said, this movie is about the struggling magician. So that whole angle of it, of him being a magician, is super fun to watch. And if this isn't like some sort of like chronicle thing where it's like, oh, now you see me. It, it, it's like real magic. You know, he's just a really good magician. It, like he, he does amazing things, but it's not like, oh, it's so unbelievable. It's believable magic. He's just really good at being a magician. And he has a special thing that he does that he's figured out to, to do a special way of doing magic. So that whole aspect of was was really cool. The whole aspect of him doing the drug dealings and all those things that were going down and that whole angle of the movie was just pretty much the bulk of the movie. That was interesting. But when these two things came together and like you didn't know how they, they were gonna like coexist in this movie because there was different parts of it. But by the ending of it, it all comes together in the way that I don't want to spoil, I don't want to tell anything about this movie. But it, 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 everything comes together so perfectly. Even like little things in the beginning that I was like, well, what does that have to really do with this movie? That adds to the story. Everything in this movie I thought was perfect for this story. It was such a well-told story, really well directed, and for the most part, well acted. I, I will say that the main actor, he is a star, Jacob, Jacob Lattimore. He did a phenomenal job. He's the guy that mostly blew me away. He was by far the best actor in this thing. I thought that if he was up here, all the other actors were down here. Not that they were awful, but there was some dialogue in this thing that was a little less than stellar, and the performances were, were okay, but he was always phenomenal and always on a higher level, so I think that he is a star to look out for here. Uh, but that is my only minor complaint with this movie, and that's not even, that's just a slight complaint, if I will. So... <laughs> The, the little acting was okay, but this movie is on such a high level of creativity and just suspense. And, like, maybe it's just because I had no idea of what to expect with this movie, but everything caught me by surprise. I had no idea what was going to happen next. I was on the edge of my seat. There were scenes where I was like, oh, you know, I would get super into it. I just... I love seeing a movie like this that I have no idea what was going to happen and it completely blown me away. If you have heard about this movie, or even if you haven't heard about it, go see this movie. I don't think you'll be disappointed. I'm going to go 5 out of 5 for Slight. It is my favorite movie of the year so far. Completely blew me away. Don't look up at what it is about even. Just, if it's playing near you, just look it up. Go see it. I, I can almost guarantee you're going to like this movie. Most people... Uh, it's such a good movie, honestly. It's a familiar kind of story with the whole drug dealing kind of thing, but it has such a cool twist to it. I don't want to say too much about it. Just go check it out. I absolutely love it. Please let me know if you see it and what you think about it. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, you want to see more reviews from a guy like me, Tom Waddle, then please like and share this video. Leave a comment down below, and most importantly, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.